for a little bit. Yeah, but it's half these achievements on here with how stupid easy they are to get. It's crazy. It's like when you go to jump into a story mode, every armor uh, ability you have, if you use it 50 times, it's an achievement. Just let me know when you're ever ready to jump into the next round. same yeah it's kind of glad my allergies have toned down with winter kicking in Sir, I'm another thing of tactical. I have no idea. <laughs> oh, earlier I just randomly at the top of my lungs screamed fucking boner nipple and I have no idea why. Caught that as it's getting us loaded into the match, I managed to kick out my double XP. <laughs> Especially with how long we still got the ba uh, for battle pass on this. I think it's like 130 something days on the battle pass. Still only like the little intro it does for all your characters just kind of just rolls through showing everybody on your team. Kill everything that moves. If it continues to move, kill it harder. Yeah, I th think I always thought that's cool. Oops. Oh. I totally thought there was a thing on the other side of that ledge and just fell to my death. Got it, there's nothing there. <laughs> and I just... 
Yeah, and it just gave me a score. It just gave me a score of negative one hundred because I committed suicide. <laughs> Hey, now I'm breaking even again. I just shot somebody. We <laughs> got my hundred back. <sighs> even though I just got fucking domed at the same time. That's weird playing this map on fucking tactical. Lost the lead. So you saw in this map always playing capture the flag. Where was he? Got him. Double kill. There's a double kill. Yeah, this one is usually a capture the flag map. Shit, I missed. Lost the lead. Oh, one th cool thing on here now. If, hey, look, turn around quick. Look what you can throw at people. <laughs> you can pick up the fusion canisters and toss them at people now. Yeah, and he gives you the metal Kong. Shit, they're up top on that balcony. Yeah, but the fusion canisters added that feature and you can pick them up, chuck them at people, you can even do it in the campaign. Yeah, and you get the metal Kong for it. I just saved your ass. <laughs> He had both me and you lined up in the sights and I just domed his ass. I think me and you both just let the same motherfucker up at the same time. Oh shit, where the hell did he just come from? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, every... Yeah, every gun that you can scope in on, it has the glint added. Yeah, only when you scope in. Yeah, but uh, it covers the battle rifle, sniper rifle, pistol. Uh, I think the rocket launcher does it too. Enemy halfway to victory. Oh shit! It's right around that corner. Yeah, he, they got me as you run run around that corner. Oh, fuck. God damn. He's somewhere up on that ledge above you. He got me as right as I was getting out of a spawn. He's picking us off as we're coming out of spawn. A fine shot. Got him. Double kill. Shit, there's still one more up there on the corner. It's to the right up there. Taking fire. Over there. Hostiles inside. 
I think he might have ditched. It's done that shit to me a couple times. Mostly on Slayer. I believe they also added a bullet drop on here a little bit. I've noticed especially using uh, some of the brute weapons that the shots drop off after a distance. Especially with the uh, spiker. Is the yeah they got us trapped again. Yeah, they got us kind of pinned in on on this spawn. There's three of them over here that I could see. I'll try to get the high ground up above you a little bit. There's. It's remaining. Another one down. Keep your head down. Ooh, deadly precision. I just. Yeah, it's kind of tricky to go that quick. Snap. Yeah, that dude just got me. He's up there in the middle of the down street. Yeah, they had the drop on us pretty good on that shit. I'm not used to that map being Slayer. It's always been Capture the Flag on that map, so that kind of thing. Every time I've played that map, it's always been Capture the Flag. That map's pretty good with the with, uh, CTF, though. Especially playing uh, one flag. One team's got uh, two offensive vehicles to play with, and then the uh, def defense team has just a mongoose to try to help move around and deploy quick and then defend the one flag. And then the rolls flip every uh, match. That shit I had. So that shit had two double kills, a reversal, Kong, Marksman, and Killjoy. Sweet. I probably go ahead and switch that shit to the standard Slayer. Oh, you can see some of the gadgets and other guns they've added in. And I'm kind of tempted to put this on the computer just to kind of see how I can do with the mouse and keyboard, but I'm still better with Halo being a controller. Yeah, it kind of sucks too. Does it, it doesn't tell you uh, who you're up against? It doesn't tell if you tell you if the person's on console or PC. It just throws you into a game with them. It doesn't tell you and show you any kind of symbol next to their name, of what they're playing on. I kind of wish they'd incorporate that. This Call of Duty's got it, where they show you what system they're on, and then if it's console or PC. So I'm kind of hoping that in the future is possibly an update. So I know the playlist update today was like 900 and something megs to add in the playlist select instead of just quick player ranked and a uh, big team battle. Kill everything that moves. If it continues to move, kill it harder. Taking damage. Spartan down. 
Shit. Damn, he got fucking tore me up with that damn battle rifle quick. Looks like there's over shield out in the middle. Ha, I got over shield. Oh, bullshit. Dude's hiding in the corner where my death marker's at. I know there's some of the new uh, guns they added in, like uh, I think it's the, I think it's called the heat shot. The bullets ricochet off the walls. Where was he at? I was just outside the corner from you. <sighs> yeah, he got me. Here, I'm right out. I'm right around the I corner from him. Incoming. God damn it. Took his shields out, then I couldn't connect a shot with his head with the assault rifle. Yeah, Slayer, it's... Slayer kind of seems bullshit on that one. If I get to the cinder shot. Bullshit that he did not die from the cinder shot. What the fuck? Yeah, it's, it's how I'm going right now, too. I'm getting my ass kicked. I'm one in seven. <laughs> the fuck? I hate that cinder shot, getting stuck in a small building with it. I hate this is this is one map I fucking hate. Got his ass. Yeah, the, uh, this map is uh, mainly I hate this fucking map. Okay, it's bullshit. I fucking meleeed him before he even fucking finished killing me. Yeah, this map is horrible though. Like free for all, I could see this map being good, but Team Slayer and shit. No. I got him as he got you. Fucking smashing us on this shit. 10 to 33. Got his ass. I got out there to get my shields. Oh. Fucking somebody was on their team just grabbed over shield. I do like they added in uh your Spartans do uh sh call outs. How oh, we got each other on that shit. Really like if I could get 
fucking grapple shot on here. Yeah, if we can get a different map than this one, it's actually better on Slayer. Yeah, he just. Yeah, he just killed both of us and he just killed us both and teabagged us both. Shit, they just spawned you on the enemy side. You should be able to have the drop on somebody. I'm waiting for them to add a uh, multiplayer to campaign. Yeah. Yeah, I'm six and fifteen. Toys are ours. Yeah. Yeah, notice the assault rifles on your you, you can't spray with them. You have to like sit there and burst fire them to get them to be like super accurate. I see a lot of people spraying and they're missing like half their shots. Well, campaign, you can get the upgraded version of the assault rifle, which is like super fucking accurate. Uh, I don't think it's the Golden Eagle. Oh, that's one of the uh, camos. But in, in in campaign, there's special variants of all the weapons that are exclusive to campaign. Just to kind of you, uh, yeah, that kind of gives you a leg up because as you're getting more and farther into the campaign, the enemies get stronger and they get a lot more aggressive. And I've noticed too. The AI system for the NPCs, the enemy has gotten smarter. They when they register that you're sniping at them and trying to shoot them from a distance, they'll actually go and try to take cover and hide. Yeah, that's why I switched to always doing hardcore. Yeah, all I play on Call of Duty is just hardcore. I think this is um, to the point I'm probably just going to play tactical. Yeah, it's kind of... I've been playing a lot of Enlisted, too, lately. <laughs> yeah, it's playing pretty good. I haven't got on it since this last update that came out like a week ago. I haven't been on it in like two weeks. Yeah, I've been busy playing Halo. I've been busy playing either uh, Halo or uh, rebooted of my Minecraft server. Double kill. Up this 
They just said we had to send two people on the enemy team rage quit. Mid game, we're certain already beating them seven to two. But they just quit mid game. Shields are down. <laughs> Taking fire. Yeah, I'm decently ways in. Yeah, I've got a handful of uh finals and stickers I've made on there in the customization shop I've got another four more that I've been working on and tweaking that I'll be posting public soon yeah as last I checked on there my uh FJB one has got a shitload of downloads Yeah, as I have two. Uh, just about the same because I made each of those separate. They each got about the same amount of downloads, but I think FJB has got the most. Yeah, just nice white, big white lettering. Just hashtag FJB. A little sticker him pointing at it saying I did that. Yeah, most of the gas pumps around Gaylord have it. And there's people getting butt hurt trying to rip them off. Exactly, I'm tempted to order a whole fucking roll of them, especially since I've seen that they're only a few bucks. Nice. <laughs> exactly. That bacon Velveeta is amazing. Halfway to victory. They got like the perfect right amount of uh, bacon put in it. Damn. What's left of their fucking team is just mopping the floor with us. You know, we're down even four on four. That is spawned in in somebody's crosshairs. My teammate just saved my ass. It's <laughs> <laughs> to the same time meleeed each other to death. Yeah, as now their fucking team is starting to pick up a little bit. We're almost neck and neck. We're just a couple kills ahead of them. Shit. Come on. 
Don't let him. Damn it, now they're taking the lead. <laughs> Damn, where the fuck did that just come? There he is. Like we go from dominating the open of the game and now they're fucking just coming back out of nowhere. Hey. Yeah, they're three kills ahead of us. Shit, god damn it. Somehow my headshot missed. And right as I spawn in, not even a couple seconds in, I get shot. Fuck, that was some bullshit. That party invite you sent me back at like 9.30 just came through on my phone. <laughs> Talk about fucking delayed. Yeah, because like none of the notifications for some reason. People send me party invites lately on the Xbox. I don't see them. And then they come across my phone like several hours later. And I'm like, what's going on? Yeah, it's fucking makes no sense. My, no, none of the notifications pop up in my system, but they come across my phone like anywhere from a half hour. I think I most I've seen is like four hours later, and then I go to accept it, and the person's not online. And then I'm sitting here like, um, hello. <laughs> Yeah, I don't like how I hear though the boost fucking even when you're not into a game, it still ticks down your fucking double XP boost. Yeah, yeah, so if you're sitting in like the little pre-game lobby, it still sits there and counts down. Just like the fucking how the Yeah, just like all the new Call of Duties you're doing, if you have any double XP shit, it sits there and counts down, but it doesn't even count that when you're in a game. So if you get up and have to like quick bathroom break or something while you're in a pregame lobby and you activate a double XP token how long over you just took in the bathroom you just lost double XP time yeah that one thing I really hope they fix in the future cause games starting to do that lately it's, it's stupid like don't dick me on double XP when I'm not in a match Yeah. Tactical Slayer. Kill everything that moves. If it continues to move, 
Kill it harder. You know, you get your time's worth. Yeah, I know a lot of these newer games kind of screw you on it now. What can I act? Domed right off the bat on start. God damn. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, exactly. Such as I'm only streaming. Yeah, such as I only stream three days a week. And then usually if I don't stream on one of my schedule nights that I have set up, it's because I'm so fucking tired from working all day, I just don't feel like doing it because I'm exhausted. Ah damn, why not spawn? Yeah, especially all these little kids that I got the rich parents using mommy and daddy's credit card to shoot through the battle passes while the rest of us are sitting here grinding. Yeah, like I, when I first started this game up, not even two days in, I ran into several people that already have the battle pass 100% of within two days. I'm still I'm like, okay, mommy and daddy buying you your shit now? You know, I'm sitting here grinding, fucking trying to get it, and I'm not even halfway through the battle pass yet. God damn, twice in a row right off in that fucking little spawn zone. Some of these spawns on some of these maps for tactical need to get fixed. I spawned twice now, right in enemy fucking crosshairs. Enemy halfway to victory. We're down by fucking five. Somebody's gonna flank me, I got that feeling. Damn, that dude fucking just pegged my ass quick. Like, damn, before you're gonna fucking ass rate me, can I at least get a warning and a little bit of lube first? Jeez. Ah, 
I fucking do the leap. Bunny hopped around the corner and fucking perfect fucking headshot my ass. Fucking A. None of, how did none of those shots connect? Well, I got one of the two. And they're all fucking hiding on their side of spawn, fucking digging in. I think it just spawned me in behind them. God damn, I'm hitting A to jump, and my damn dude won't jump. Down. Uh, I don't think so. Oh, yeah. Now you mentioned them like that. Yeah, I fucking... I've been seeing a lot of them. They're fucking annoying as fuck. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I've seen harder shit come out of his fucking kid's cereal box. Fuck did he know I was there? Dude, I just fucking spawned. Fuck. No. How the fuck? There, hostiles in sight. Yeah. I got how the fuck half them dudes are fucking hot me that damn quick. Like, I don't even have the time to fucking even respond to them pulling their damn gun up in time.
Yeah, it's been doing that with uh, Bentley's Xbox account here. Where it constantly sits there and shows him going offline and then come back on and offline back online. It's been doing that to his shit constantly. Oh, honestly, something with Xbox Live has been fucking up lately. It's fucking weird. Plus, I know Bentley, he's got the older, out-of-date system, but it still runs fine. But it shouldn't be fucking up. <laughs> Tactical Slayer. Ooh, now here's a map I actually like. You gotta say, out of the past Halo games that 343 have done, this is one of the better ones. Yeah. But 4 and 5, I, especially 5, I did not like 5. A fine shot. But the storyline, good. Online, complete garbage. Yeah, and then Halo 5, only thing that was good on there was literally just the storyline. The online was so damn cancerous, it was damn near unplayable. But this one, they seem like they've worked out a lot of their bugs and went back towards their more of their older setup. It's still just more kind of getting used to the controls again. So since I've seen a lot of old gamer tags that I've seen playing the older Halos that I somewhat remember popping up on here again. We've seen a bunch of the older Halo streamers coming back. <laughs> yeah. He's a shitty ass gamer anyways. Fuck ninja. You lost the teammate. Oh, the shields. <laughs> yeah, it's hilarious half the time fucking seeing him rage quit out of his games. Just seeing random people put up stuff, clips of him rage quitting it, fucking it's hilarious. Getting his ass kicked middle of a game, it's fuck this. <laughs> Yeah, I'm kind of getting my ass kicked in these last few rounds. <laughs> He's too much of an arrogant little asshole for me. I'm 
Like, if he'd toned his shit down a few levels, maybe he'd be a little more tolerable, but other than that, fuck. Damn, that dude fucking snapped. I little pegged him once and he snapped fucking 90 degrees and fucking popped my ass. Nearing victory. gonna sit here for a second because I got a feeling this spot's gonna be decent. I hate that fucking bunny hop headshot shit. That is fucking annoying. I gotta get used to that fucking this new swap mode on here. Yeah, I got like a, got like another week and a half, and I got a renew my uh, ultimate membership. Yeah, all you got to do is buy a 12-month gold card, and then buy a one-month ultimate card, and it immediately reverts your entire one-year gold into a year of ultimate. It's a little cheaper than buying their fucking... Because they don't sell a year of ultimate. They only go up to six months and it's cheaper just to buy the gold card and then spend a little extra just to buy one month of ultimate and then have the whole thing convert over. Yeah, basically, you just buy a one-year Xbox Live gold card and then just buy a one-month ultimate card. And it converts your entire one year membership into ultimate and then adds in that one month, so I'll have 13 months of ultimate. Yeah, it's a little kind of cheap money saving trick I figured out. And I've been doing it since ultimate came out. And it's just a neat little way to save yourself a little bit extra money. Yeah, it's like 50, 50, 60 bucks for one year, and then you spend another 15 bucks for one month of ultimate, and it converts over to 13 months of ultimate. Six, about 60, 70 bucks, and you'll have an, it's 13 months of ultimate. Uh, if you... Uh, I've been using it on my PC too. It, as long as you have your Xbox app on the computer, you can full use the Game Pass access on it too. Yeah. I've got several Game Pass games. Through. Yeah, that's how I've originally got uh, all the Age of Empire games and before I bought them.
Yeah, and it gives you di- and you get the uh, PC game discounts through Ultimate on their Game Pass games. You get a discount buying the game. Like I bought the Age of Empires Definitive Collection for I think it was originally marked at like 40, 50 bucks. I got it for 20 bucks. Mm-hmm. And then I just bought the Age of Empires 4. It was a uh, $10 off buying it because I had a Game pa- uh, Game Pass Ultimate subscription. But I've got all four of the Age of Empires installed. I've got fucking a bunch of other games installed all through Game Pass right now. Because the Game Pass games I can't install them to my external hard drive. They have to be installed to the internal hard drive of my computer, which doesn't have a whole lot of space. <laughs> the internal hard drive for that, it only had a 500 gig internal. But I've got a several terabyte external for some reason with the Game Pass, because you don't officially own it, it doesn't want you to save it on an external drive like you own it. So usually if I want to check the game out, I'll download it through Game Pass. If I like it, I'll buy it, as long as it's decently priced. Tactical Slayer. <laughs> but that's how I got Age of Empires 4. I played it to see if I'd like it at all. And second, I liked it as I liked it, bought it. So I like the first three Age of Empires. But I seen that they changed a bunch of shit with number four. So I decided to test it first. See if I like it, buy it. Kill everything that moves. If it continues to move, kill it harder. I still like my AI in here. Fucking tactical slayer comes up. Kill everything that moves. If it still moves, kill it harder. Gain the lead. Oh, fuck yeah. If it's twitching, hit it. Double kill. I think I just rounded that corner and those two people knew they were dead, so they just stopped moving. Damn it, they got me. Yeah, at least I haven't ran into any people running around to that FaZe Clan bullshit. Uh, people running around with the FaZe Clan skin they have on here. I just blind punched and got him. Halfway to victory. I don't know who that was that just saved my ass, but thank you. Somebody beat me that shot. Uh, of course you're hiding. <laughs> you're dead.
What, what about the hippie on my firewood? Yeah, that fucking tree hugger's annoying. Nope. Many of us. Uh, we're only three in the lead. Oh, they have a hidden metal on here. I just remembered it. If you use a grenade to bounce a weapon towards you and catch it in midair and switch to it, you get the metal combat evolved. Yeah, it's uh, a feature they had in the combat evolve game that you could grenade bounce the guns to your hand they brought it back and you get a medal for doing it I ended up seeing a couple videos on TikTok and I didn't think it was real until I actually seen somebody do it in a live stream and seen it pop up fuck now we're down by two Team nearing victory. God damn it. Fuck, this dude's just bluntly, fucking blindly spawn killing. Who people spawn kill? Like, that shit doesn't take any skill to do. Like, if you're gonna. If you have to spawn kill just to get kills, fuck off. Shit, reload, reload. Yes. by three points. At least I pulled positive that game. At least that game I went 12 and 8. Good way to end the stream for the night. <laughs> eh, finishing out positive for the last handful of games. Uh, probably in a little bit, yeah. So I gotta get up in... Like, five and a half hours. <laughs> now I'm gonna be playing the shit out of this more tomorrow. Won't have Be uh, Bentley over, so... I don't have to worry about... Stop and help take care of him at all. Yeah. Yeah, me and Bentley were grinding on this just the other day before they did the playlist update. Me and him were fucking annihilating people. That little shit is really good on here. Yeah, I already know he's probably gonna rewatch this too. <laughs> He likes rewatching all my uh, any streams I missed. I upload them on YouTube. He usually watches them. Well, everybody, thanks for tuning in tonight's live stream. If you have not ready, be sure to click that follow button. For everybody on YouTube, subscribe, click the bell, give it a thumbs up, and I will catch everybody later.